In this video, I'll show you how you can start running Kelosort and Phi on electrophysiology data in minutes. Once you log in, you'll be taken to the Tools page where you'll select Kelosort. The first thing we'll do is go to the Channel Map parameter and select a data file from your data page. Here, I'm using an example data folder we've made available to all users, which contains data from a NeuroPixels probe, so that's the channel map we'll use. Next, we'll do the same process to select some recording data, which in this example is the first minute of an open data set published by the Cortex Lab. The Kelosort Tools page is pre-populated with suggested parameters that you can leave as is or adjust as needed for your data, and you'll just click Launch to start running Kelosort. While the tool is running, you can keep track of how it's going by looking at the Logs tab, or you can step away and come back when it's done. Once a run is done, results appear in the Results tab of the Run Details and in the Tool Output folder of your data page. We can then go back to the Tools page, this time select Phi, and choose our newest Kelosort Results folder from the Tool Output folder and hit Launch. In a few moments, the Interact button will appear. Clicking the Interact button opens the Phi Interactive Data Visualizer. From here, you can customize your view and start sorting through your Kelosort results and manually annotating units. If you close the window, you can pick up right where you left off for 30 minutes before the program terminates due to inactivity. You can also manually quit the session. Your edits are automatically saved and you can download your results from the results tab in the Phi Run Details. And congratulations, you've just run Kelosort and Phi without having to spend any time on setup.